As musicians, we spend hours upon hours perfecting our craft. We spend time learning how to play in tune, in time, with a good sound. And then on top of all of that, we have to learn how to play musically. We have to elicit a response from our listeners and communicate some sort of feeling or emotion. So today I'm going to share with you one of the concepts I've gotten from the Lindemann Sobel Potts approach that has allowed me to be a more musical player. And this concept is that music is made up of entrance notes. So when I'm playing a phrase, I'm not worried about the long note. I'm worried about the entrance notes. And the entrance note is the front of every note. So if I've got a long note, it's those shorter notes that come after it. Or if I've got two longer notes, it's just the front of the next note. I'm always going to the next note. My eye is always moving ahead to what's coming up. To give you an example of this, if you listen to Frank Sinatra, he doesn't sing, I get no kick from champagne, mere alcohol, it doesn't move me at all. He doesn't hold out those long notes. He's on to the next entrance note. I get no kick from champagne. Mere alcohol, it doesn't move me at all. So he's not concerned about the long note, it's about the entrance note coming up. To give you another perspective on this, if I take a Bordoni etude and I play it with that, that love of the long note, where, where I'm just holding on to that long note and not thinking about the entrance notes coming up, I get this. Now I'll play it again, and this time I'll have my eye move ahead when I'm on the long note. So I'm not just static on that note, but I'm going to the entrance notes that are coming up. 